Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. 8 years ago, India was recognized as world's largest defense importer and it is still dependent on foreign firms and governments for its defense systems. However, the tide is slowly changing its direction with government's impetus on self-reliance, make in India and schemes such as IDEX which is encouraging private players to actively involve in design, development and production of defense systems. The efforts put across is now showing its result. India's defense export has grown by eight times in the last five years. India is now exporting to more than 75 countries. In the financial year 2021, the total defense export amounted to $1.5 billion. Now recently, during the Defense Expo, the Prime Minister Narendra Modi has given a target of achieving $5 billion in defense export by 2025. The Brahmos Chairman and Managing Director is confident of achieving this target just with the sale of Brahmos Missile. The Brahmos Aerospace had bagged $375 million export order in 2021 for Brahmos Missile from Philippines and is expecting to get more orders. Talks are also in progress for the export of Brahmos Missile with Vietnam, Malaysia, Egypt and many other countries. In 2021, Indian Armed Forces have conducted numerous tests of BrahMos missile. Few of them also include BrahMos missile with extended range. The baseline BrahMos or its first version has a range of 295 km. The BrahMos missile which was tested on 11th January 2021 from Indian Navy's destroyer INS Vishakapatnam was an extended range BrahMos missile. While there is no official confirmation on the missile range, it is expected close to 500 km. The extended range was achieved only with the software upgrade. On 22nd September 2022, the Ministry of Defense announced that Indian Navy has ordered the ship-borne version of supersonic BrahMos at an overall approximate cost of Rs. 1700 crore. Now, as per few reports, the order was for 35 combat and 3 practice BrahMos missile for two Project 15 B-class warship which is INS Vishakapatnam and INS Murmugaon, which can strike targets out to 500 km range. On 13th March 2022, the ANI has published a report on BrahMos missile. Now, as per the report, the range of air-launched BrahMos missile, also known as BrahMos ALCM or BrahMos A, has already been extended to 800 km. On 12th May, the MOD reported the first test fire of air-launched extended-range BrahMos missile from Su-30MKI. Now, this test may be a developmental trial of 800 km range BrahMos A missile. The extended-range BrahMos will have greater range when compared to ship-borne or land version as it will have advantage of altitude and the speed of launch platform which is Su-30MKI. There are further plans to even extend this range up to 1500 kilometers. In near future, the Indian Air Force will be armed with new lethal and versatile BrahMos NG supersonic cruise missile system. At present, BrahMos NG is under design and developmental stage. The developmental trials on the missile will commence from 2013 to 2024, and the missile is expected to be ready by 2025. BrahMos NG will be lighter and smaller in dimension compared to its predecessors, making it lighter and compatible with most of the fighter jets in Indian Air Force inventory. The aircrafts need not to undergo a structural modification for the integration of BrahMos NG, unlike Su-30 MKI, which had to undergo hardening in certain sections of its fuselage to be able to carry BrahMos A missile. At present, the air launch BrahMos is only compatible with Su-30 MKI considering its huge dimension and weight and a fighter jet is able to carry only one BrahMos A missile at its center line pylon. With the development of BrahMos NG, the Su-30 MKI will be able to carry one BrahMos A at center line pylon and two BrahMos NG at the inner wing pylons. Su-30 MKI will also be able to carry five BrahMos NG missiles and LCA will be able to carry Two of them. The BrahMos NG will weigh 1330 kilograms, which is almost half of the present BrahMos A missile, weighing close to 2500 kilograms. The BrahMos NG will have a length of 6 meters, 
2.4 meters smaller than BrahMos A missile. The BrahMos NG will have a range of 300 kilometers with a max speed of Mach 3.5. Each BrahMos NG missile will cost approximately 2.6 million dollar and 50% cheaper than the air-launched BrahMos. The cost of BrahMos A is approximated around 5.5 million dollars. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We will soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.